Hello, welcome to Rad System Studio. My name is Tuzik. In this video tutorial, we will learn how to style page background image using CSS. I'm using Rad Systems version 5.1.3 PHP Rad Classic. For this tutorial, I will be using a project I've created already. Now let's get started. Starting with authentication. Because I will be style the login index page, I'm going to enable authentication to have that page created. Once done, click OK and then publish our project. Before we continue, let's have a look of our project. Now we have login index page after enabling authentication. Let's move forward to style this page. Back to Rad System Studio, click on the page design from the top navigators. Rad Systems provide page custom JS and custom CSS. This enables developer to write CSS and JavaScript code that will take effect on selected page only. I will be using this current page being the index page. There are two methods of style an element background image. First option is to style the page body element tag. Second option is to create and style CSS class. Starting with the first option, click on the page CSS code action button, CSS text editor pops up, we are going to style in between these style tags. So I'm going to target the body tag, just like the, then give it a background property. Let's set the value to URL. Then provide location path of the image we want to use. Now click OK. But before we publish our project, let's make sure we have our media file on the right place. Click on the Project Explore button from the top navigators. Over here on the left, click on the public folder, from the right, click on the images folder, here, you can add the image file you want. Let me quickly do that. Once done let publish our project then preview it on browser. Background image enabled, that looks pretty. You can set the background to any image media file of your choice. Now let's move to the second method. This method is basically the same with the first, the difference is that we are going to style a class, instead of the elements tag. With this we can give any element the class property and our background image takes effect on the elements. Let's call this class BGIMG2. Then add few more property to be able to fit on elements with small width. Therefore, I'm going to add the background size property, and then set it to cover. Also I'm going to add the background position, and then set it to center. You can go on and on to add desirable properties to suit your preference. Once done, click OK, publish and preview project on the browser. So far, our background image is off, and that because we changed to method 2. Let's add the BGIMG2 class we styled to an element, I'm going to add it to the section class. And that will look like this. We can also add it to the index login card wrapper class. Let's publish and then preview in the browser. Now we've learned how to style page background image. Thank you for joining us today. Most importantly, if you've not subscribed to our channel, Please subscribe for more tutorial videos like this and don't forget to like, comment and share. Hopefully, I'll meet you in the next tutorial. Thank you.